Yes, my computer is set up in my garage because my camcorder, GoPro Hero 3 Black Edition, does not like the light in the house. I'm unboxing a Western Digital My Book USB 3 2 terabyte essentials hard drive. Here's the drive. USB 3 connector, paper, packaging, trash, quick start guide, useless. Power supply. So, here's a drive, brand new, just out of the box. Put the power supply in. And the drive is recognized by Windows. So now, if I go to my computer, I have two internal drives and the external drive with everything that came on the hard drive. Now, I'm even going to, even though you don't have to, is actually eject the drive. actually need the cables what I'm gonna do next you probably shouldn't use a knife to do this there are two clips on each side and back Do this at your own risk, too. Then the drive just slides out. Get the cover. If you actually care about this little disconnected from the PCB board. Sorry for that, I thought I had everything ready to go and forgot I needed a screwdriver. One screw. Take the board off. Sorry, two screws and a bracket. Oh, and the drive that is inside of my book, 2 terabyte, is a WD green standard SATA 64 megabyte cache hard drive. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this Rosewill IDE SATA connector connects through USB port. Connect 
solder a cable to it. And we wait a few moments. Now, as you notice, nothing happened. So we'll go to disk management. We go to disk management again. And it says, you must initialize a disk before logical disk manager can access it. Disk two. And that is this drive. Because for some reason Western Digital thought it'd be a great idea to encrypt track zero with their adapter board. I don't know who this would actually benefit. Because how many people can actually afford the 500 to 2100 dollars that I've been quoted to recover their hard drives. If you can afford that, then you're probably not worried about one drive failing because you've got 10 redundant backups. And seeing as I don't plan on using this disk in that external enclosure, I am going to initialize it. And then new simple volume. The whole thing is one drive. Call it 2TB. I'm just formatting it. And there is the empty folder for the drive. Go back to my computer, properties, and I don't know if it's showing up on camera that well, but free is 1.81 terabyte. And now it'll operate just as any other hard drive, just because of that PCB that connects it to USB and encrypts track zero, makes it useless as a backup. Uh, in the past week and a half, I've lost two and a half terabyte of video due to this problem. Hope this helps you. I know where you're at if this has already caused you data loss. And Western Digital so far is of no help. They actually deny having the hardware encryption. Actually what I can do, what I will do, I'll eject the drive. Wrong end. That's better. I guess we need some power. I believe I need to go back into disk management. And again, because that disk encrypts the drive and can't find the original track zero that it created, it wants to initialize the disk again. So now, one last time.
and it's recognized because I did not initialize it with the PCB board on there. So again, I hope this helps you out. If you have a WD USB 3 drive, get all your data off it as soon as you possibly can. If you just bought it, return it. Thanks for watching.